List of people who will miss me when I am gone. You didn't say anything. You just waved. Are you not gonna miss me? You didn't prepare me. I got <laughs> camera shy. Are you gonna miss me? I'm. You're gonna miss me about my hair. I'm gonna miss you like I miss a rock in my shoe. Oh my gosh. <laughs> of course I'm gonna miss you. Yay! London! Here you come. I just arrived at the airport. Thank for the ride. Thank. Thank. You're welcome for the ride. This is just a person. Don't worry about him. He's yeah. cool. Stop it. I am in Detroit. My connecting flight leaves in like... How long, Jenna? An hour? An hour? Less than an hour. We're boarding now. I thought we boarded. Like, we're, Oh, we are boarding, boarding now. now. We're boarding we now. like 50 minutes. Say hi, Jenna. I need to take a large <laughs> sleeping pill <laughs> and knock myself out for eternity. <laughs> See you in London. Either we just arrived on a new sunless planet or we are in London. How cute. This is your guys' idea of a heat wave. We just got honked at for accidentally being in the middle of the road. Welcome to London. Hey guys, this is one of my roommates, Mikhail. She's Hi. really, really cool. <laughs> she's a, I guess she's okay, I guess. Well, I'll talk more about her, but I mean as soon as she leaves the room, I guess. Awkward. I'm in London. I am in London. Ah. I've been up for a long time. Actually, on the plane I slept because I took drugs. Don't do drugs, kids. I mean, I mean legal. Legal drugs. No, I'm just kidding. No, really. Legal drugs. Spent, you know, about 50 years on the tube trying to get to our destination, the flat where we're staying. Did you eat it? Oh, no, it's right here. A Kinder Egg. Seen these things on Tumblr like a thousand times and I thought I should try one. I'm on a bunk bed. I'm on the top of the bunk bed. Eight-year-old me saw this video right now. She'd be so jealous. This is weird. This feels weird. Whoa. The frick is in the middle. Is that a toy? I thought it was like different chocolate. No. Oh. I and I got a faceless minion. I don't know what this is. Oh, it opens. I see. I got <laughs> whatever the heck these things are. Look at them. They're little cogs and gears in them. What is this? I don't understand what you do with this. Uh, uh, huh. Whatever the heck that is. Impressions of London so far. I think the metaphor I used was... What was it, Mikkel? It was... A grumpy, old, lovable lady. You know, like your semi-racist great-grandmother? That's London. It's just really old and very small. The people here are, they're not mean per se, but of course I've only been here a few hours really, but they're not mean per se, but they, they're definitely not going out of their way to help out other people. You know what I mean? So other than that, it's beautiful and they love the city. It's weird because I'm not, I don't feel jet lagged at all. I feel okay. I'm so tired, I may just die. The pillows we get at this hostel, or whatever you want to call it, are just so hard. They're like rocks. I have to buy a pillow, but I can't. Not yet. Why are all the drinks here warm? The fridge isn't that cold, and, and the drinks, the water, like the tap water, doesn't get that cold. I don't understand what's happening. Having a bit of a culture shock day. I want... Some properly chilled milk and a water bottle is just weird random crap. Anyway, I'm just being a wimp. I'll get over it. I need to get some sleep. We're going to a play tonight. We're going to a Midsummer Night's Dream at the Globe Theater. Okay, so we already came down this many stairs. And now we've got all these stairs. And then we've got all these stairs. This is so much fun to walk up and down at 8 a.m. I just missed a step and almost died. And then we've got these stairs. And we've got Nati Natisha's, Natasha's feet. Natisha. And then we've got these stairs. And, and then there is a basement with more stairs. We are going to the Globe Theater to watch A Midsummer Night's Dream. I'm pretty excited. Say hello. 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 You already sound British. <laughs> Look at this. It's crazy. Ooh. Sorry, I just realized I'm not giving a very good 
clear view. So right now we're past the Queen's Shotgun. Gate. That's the Royal Albert Hall. And then there is the Albert Monument. It is so beautiful. The Royal Albert Hall. It's like the, uh, it's like the Beatles song. I'm just in constant, like, shock of this place. You just have stuff everywhere, like historical monuments everywhere. How do you deal with that? Maybe it's less special to you. I don't know, but it's pretty dang special to me. <gasps> the regiment! This looks like my kind of party, actually. I got soul, but I'm not a soldier. Hey, Camille. Yep? Is this the lake where they filmed that boat scene in What a Girl Wants? I believe so. I see the boats. Look at these dang fish. Where'd they go? Oh, where'd they go? Oh, look at that guy. Oh, disgusting. Oh, hello. He just, what the heck is that? That's a weird looking bird. Hey, buddy. Name one after me and Camille, but if there's only one, name it after me. Hey, Hermes, looking good. There's a pigeon on your head and you're wrestling a fish. Hey, y'all, my name is Queen Elizabeth and welcome to my crib. It's sick that I've been humming Sweeney Todd to myself pretty much this whole walk. British and loyal, you might enjoy Royal Marine. Anyway, it's clean. But of course it tastes of wherever it's been. This is my very first thing of fish and chips, and I'm not gonna lie, it looks pretty good. Oh no. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> it's really oh. good. <laughs> Found Twinkies. Legit hostess Twinkies. And I'm gonna buy one and eat it. You're right, it's really gross. I told you. <laughs> but I'm probably just gonna finish it anyway. Who's gonna take the Pandora cup from me tonight? In bath today. Check out this guy. Sing along if you know it. If you're happy and you know it, clap your hands. Be really upset if they don't have a gym here called Bath and Body Works. So maybe I was a little freaked out to be in another country at first, lost some sleep, wasn't able to figure out these grocery stores. You know, I'm glad I came here. Um, it's scary and I miss my familiarity with the land, but I honestly think it's worth it to be here. I'm having a lot of fun. I'm seeing beautiful things I never would have been able to see before and I'm making awesome friends and I'm just having a really, really Good time. And I'm pretty excited to see what happens next.